On this week's episode of Unfunny People and Cars Getting Stuff, Sid and Jamie are driving a 1994 Pontiac Firebird, a 3.4 litre V6 hardtop, made by the Pontiac division of General Motors, in Detroit bankrupt red. That, I mean, that's... <laughs> Do you want, do you want do that, again? Do that 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 What's that? What, you know when I got in the car? <laughs> what did you do with the keys? Did I put the keys? You need keys I've never for... done this before. <laughs> I have never... I think I'm sat on them. <laughs> I've never got in the car. I've not just gone... Oh, better put go. the keys in the ignition, have I? Sounds <laughs> nice. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Look. Probably come with that. That is in the conspiracy theory, by the way, when I say that. We're not actually killing Madonna. I think my door might need a bit of oil. What do you reckon? It's a 20 year old American Sporker. <laughs> He's only got 70,000 miles on the clock. Alright, 70 real thousand miles. Well, this is the thing, right? It's a 20 year old car with 70,000 miles on the clock. <laughs> uh, I don't think I'm even on this car. Are you enjoying this? Yeah, it's brilliant. Yeah. I'm living the dream here. Yeah, but we'll both be on that one, won't we? Hopefully. Hopefully. Yeah. So, in the emergency, here's your horn. Ready? Okay, that's quite good. There is a horn, ah. right? But it's good though. I think all cars should have this, right? Because you know you're driving along and someone does a minor infraction, and you're like, you, f and then you go, oh, hang on, the the horns on the, <laughs> there's a little bunny after each other. But most of the time you go, you motherfucker, you cut me. <laughs> oh, it's, it's all right. So, here we go, episode one, uno, I am shooting up the A429, which, you know, sounds like a Biker Grove drug documentary. So you don't think we're doing this properly. You might even be able to hear us over the car. <laughs> oh, the, the most interesting fact of the journey so far is that your petrol tank's probably on your side of the car. It is on my side, yeah. Is that a big deal? No, why, is, why is that interesting? Well, just because you, you have a left-hand drive car and my car's a right-hand drive, and so the petrol... The petrol tank, would be he's a right-hand side car. Yeah, but that's not a that's car, a, that's a piece of shit. That's a, you know, SUV. It's a Hyundai Santa Fe, how can you call that a piece of shit? CRDI. <laughs> it's a piece of shit. Yeah. That means it's got a CD player. Let's just see what Sid's got in the back of his car. We've got some... Uh, Thing bats, which oh, Aston Martin just go past there. Maybe you could do a few. Aston Martin? Yeah. Compact car. Bow tie. Panda car. So the thing that really pisses me off about petrol stations, I only go in for fuel. They don't have any fuel for me. They have junk food for me. Oh, yeah, but the thing is, you never, you never can buy anything from petrol stations because their markup's like, what, 75% on everything? Well, I just paid 70p for a pack of chewing gum. Yeah. What would it be anywhere else in a normal shop? I've, I've not bought chewing gum for years. Are we heading towards the car wash now? Do you want, is that what you want to do? I think let's go and see if the car wash is open. Okay. I think that could be a good transition shop. What do we, we want the cheapest car wash we can get. You don't definitely want to, don't want to spend 60 quid, do you? 60? What do I get for that? Do I get a blowjob with that as well? <laughs> you fucking hope so. <laughs> God, this is... He to stop. <laughs> He's like, stop! <laughs> Was he? Yeah. He wasn't making a clear. This, um... Enjoy. It's a bit hostile, isn't it? <laughs> How are we doing, man? Just a basic watch, I think you fucked up that camera when you moved it. That one? Yeah. I think it was better as it was. It was cool, because it was pointing towards you more. Well, no, it was central, dude. It was central. I shouldn't be able to see the sides on either side of the camera. It should be central. I mean, obviously, I see a bit of that side. Well, I can see a bit of this side. Yeah, but not as much as I can on that side, I'll wager. 
<laughs> Hope you're enjoying the first episode. Yeah, they're gonna be loving it. I think he wants you to move. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> What's that hole? That's in not the... good. I can't see a fucking thing. What's that hole in the wall? They've covered up with a bin liner. That's the rape shed. That's the gayest wave I've ever seen. <laughs> shame, not, shame our two viewers can't see it. MTV! MTV! <laughs> I'm I'm boy. Yeah. He's like putting weed kit on it now. <laughs> there is a bit of green growing on in a few oh, places. Oh, it's really so. Oh, I got wet! <laughs> you really did, sir. Like, look! <laughs> <laughs> it's all wet! Well, it would be, wouldn't yeah. it? You don't expect the car to be waterproof, do you? Yes! That's the wettest looking Xiaomi I've seen since Neil Morrissey. Oh, fucking hell, what have you done to the seat? It was, that's how it was. They're more gentle on the door, mate. That's why they make that noise, isn't it? This is fucking horrible, actually, being inside the side of my car. I, I, I can't think of anything more unnatural. <laughs> Don't forget to hit subscribe.